Now here's the river twisting and turning through the fields. It comes round this final bend then disappears under this old stone bridge and heads out over here but on this side it's completely different because it divides into two and those are not the courses of a natural river. They're man-made, they're drainage ditches. Now in Leyland's day the river poured into Mere Pool and disappeared which means that that big green field over on the right there must be the northern part of what was Mere Pool. Which means that if I follow this public footpath here I should be able to walk right across the middle of what was Mere Pool to its southern shore.